well, this Army runs on coffee. To stay in motion, to get everything done that we need to do, uh, we start every morning with coffee. We hit the ground running and, uh, and we're off. My name is Patty Geisinger. I am the mother of uh, four children. We were always very busy. School, work, family unit was very important and you did things with your family. We find ways to volunteer and stay active in everything that we do. And it's just about staying in motion. My family is crazy. <laughs> We're always going out to go do things. Um, we go nonstop and we always like to do it together. My name is Mary and my older sister is Jessica. Jessica stopped breathing at five weeks old due to RSV and pneumonia and she suffered massive brain damage. When you have a child with so many medical needs, it takes a lot of work. So our, our daily life is usually very scheduled. Now that Jessie's out of school, we have tried to put into place a transition plan, building upon the relationships that she enjoyed. All right. Today is her future. She has to be engaged today. We don't think about the past. We don't think about the future. What is she doing today? There we go, Jessie. Music therapy is there to help bring out her senses. She's very confined by her wheelchair. And so music therapy really helps stretch her out and it gets her to be really hearing and seeing and experiencing um, so that she's not just in the same environment. That was so nice, Jessie. It's good to see you. We um, are fortunate to have a funding program that does pay for some therapies, and part of our week is spent getting Jessie to these therapies so that she can interact with people around her. <laughs> Time to say goodbye. Literally, it's the, a giant smile. <laughs> <laughs> Jessie loves to go bowling. She loves bowling. She really likes the sounds and the environment inside of a bowling alley. My name is Brenda Lance. I'm a recreation therapist. With Jessie, we work on a recreational activity that gives her joy in her life. She lifts her head up more, she'll smile. So she's indicating enjoyment and interaction within the activity. Bowling really helps with her scoliosis in her hands. Stretching her hand out onto the ball stretches the muscles in there because her hands just curl up and they'll just stay very tense and tight. And the bowling really helps with that. Nice shot though, Patty. Patty is the most amazing woman I've ever met. She is a great caregiver. She tries to give her as much stimulation, as much therapy, as much interaction as she needs. Jessie has taught me how much fun life is and how much fun you can make it. Even though there may be some difficulties, you can always have fun. We don't know how long we have with Jessica. They gave us a terminal diagnosis when she was six. She's 24 now. The future is today, but the future is tomorrow and the next few years. We can't say how long she's gonna be with us. This is what we have and I'm not gonna get upset about it. I'm just gonna work hard and, and do what we need to do. You never know, you're gonna say goodnight and you're gonna hope she's still there in the morning. But you better make sure that day was the best day, just in case, just in case.
I love having Jessie as my sister. She's the greatest. I can't imagine my life without her. God left her here because she still has something to do. But she doesn't do anything. She just is. And that's what we get out of it. We get her here with us. She's brought to me the realization that I need to work really hard on myself. I owe that to her and we're building memories today for the time that she's not here. I think our future really looks a lot like it does today. Include Jesse, go, 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 and just enjoy life as much as we physically possibly can.